Most welcome my friend in our channel we are started microbiology notes online study and first we started history of microbiology and then we have started the details of the surface detail morphological details of this bacterial cell walls what this bacteria in the later section we go for the details first we need to understand what is the bacterial cell wall and the part of cells what the responsible their works in last video we just studied the flagella similar type of the name is the fibrins the, what the fibrins how can how they are differ from the flagella what are the structures and they are like look like the just like the flagellins flagella but they are sim not involved in any type of mobility mutality that means the motion of these things they are shorter than flagella but they are present in all around the cells so they can be differ from the flagella either they are shorter and more in number as compared to the flagella flagella is also responsible for the motion but they are not responsible for the motion they are only responsible for cells attachment yeah adherence with the surface surface and they are also responsible for heme agglutination process the cell clumping process of the bacteria so you can imagine you can make the differ from the flagella fibrins are the two other things and both are differ from their functions their uh, numbers their structures also another surface structure also found there is a phyla is in the surface there is a three things in the found in the bacterial cells is the one is the flagella and there is the like the fibrins and smaller than fibrins and they are less in number is called the phyla this player morphologically and chemically similar to fibrins but few in number and smaller in size they are smaller in numbers and capable of fibrins they are only responsible for the transfer of the dna genetic material they transfer the process is called the bacterial conjugation from one bacterial cell to another bacterial cell they can join their five pili and transfer their dna a genetic material to one to another structure that's why they are called the sex pili a fertility pili a f pili this word is very common f pili what is the means of f pili you don't confuse with the fibrins that uh, also in similar type of but their function is different all these flagella fibrins and pili all have the separate functions and they are responsible for the separate things and their numbers their size all are the differ from to each other now we are coming in the another things of the the bacterial cell wall is the capsules and slim layers what is the means or when they differ because most of the bacteria have the capsules and some few bacteria have the slim layers many bacteria secrete the eps extracellular polysaccharide some bacteria or most of the bacteria secreting this is associated with the exterior of bacterial cell wall they can form there is covering of the bacterial cell walls these are eps extracellular polysaccharide contain 2% carbohydrate 98% waters so they are produce glamis exterior of the cell wall there is a some circular there is a some mucus type of structure is present morphologically two extreme form of existence one is the capsules one is the similar these things either there is solid and there is the like there is a hard then is called capsules when they are just like loose your yeah, mucus type structure is called slim the function of this is the capsule is the form the rigid tightly associated with the cell slim is the which is loosely associated with the cells that means that the capsules are very tightly close and they are tightly bind with the cells while the slims are not slims are just associated here yeah, just around the cells they can easily remove by the some technical methods so these type of things now we are coming in the functions of the capsules and slims they protect from the desiccation that is my heat that is may some time of there is a temperature warm weather sometimes with unfavorable conditions so these are helping the cells by protecting from this the undesired conditions or yeah, unfavorable conditions so these things need to that they provide protection barrier against the penetration board biocides some chemicals they can inhibit to enter inside the cells they protect against the engulfing of phagocytic cells they also in part protozoan cells they cannot be digested by the protozoas and phagocyte who have when they are covering by the pro capsules or proto uh, slim layers they may be promote the stability of bacterial suspension preventing the cells aggregation and settling they are also very responsible for this functions 
they may promote attachment of bacterial cells to surface this is when the unfavorable condition they are playing very important role for the bacterial attachment and bacterial settlement bacterial time pass for this unfavorable condition to favorable condition just like in the hibernating state and they can protect the bacterial cells from undesirable condition situation so these are the some things we need to understand in next video some detail about the cell structure thank you so much for watching and giving your times in this video please subscribe my channel hope you like it thank you